So this is an example of a homemade speaker that actually works. Um, all I did to make it was I took an old pair of headphones like this and I took the plug off of the end of it, I tore it out of the wire, and I got this little metal piece. I attached some alligator clips to the, uh, the metal that is inside of the wire. And I attached the other end of the alligator clips to both of the ends of a very long piece of copper wire. The copper wire I coiled many, many times into a bunch of loops and wrapped them around a very large spool. And then I took a magnet, that's what this donut thing is. This is a pretty big magnet that I suspended in the tube by taping it on both sides to the inside. So the tube is hollow, you can kind of see the magnet in the back. All you need to do is make sure you have a coil that's hooked up to the headphone plug. And then you need a magnet that's suspended as close to the coil as you can get it. Here I chose tape because it holds it in place and it still makes it so it's able to move a tiny bit. And if you plug it in to anything that plays music, and have it play the music, you will hear the music coming out. It's pretty quiet, it's not uh, at all even loud enough, as loud as a pair of regular headphones, but it's a pretty cool thing to be able to uh, know how to make. Uh, so that's a working homemade speaker.